Guy walks into a psychiatrist's office wearing nothing but cling wrap. The psychiatrist looks at him and says, Sir, I can clearly see your nuts. <laughs> Cheers! Welcome to Chewy's Chow. You're uh, going to make some cake today. This is a uh, childhood favorite of my own. My mother's always made this cake, but I decided to step it up a notch and tweak it a little. Normal people wear aprons. Here in Chewy's Chow, we wear cut-off jean shirts. Alright, a little sip of vino and let's begin this journey. Okay, so today we're going to make a lemon-lime cake. Um, I'm going to throw some blueberries in there and uh, sprinkle a little lavender in the nice cream frosting. So what I've got here is a nice basic lemon cake mix, nice and moist, hopefully. So I'm going to kick that guy on. I'm going to throw in three eggs. Third cup oil. And one of the third cup water. Get those threes ready. Going to Vegas in October, look out. So it's mixing around pretty nice here. Just want it to become nice and smooth, no lumps. Kick it up a little bit, just whip it the shape here. Oh yeah, it's coming together real quick. as well monopolize on this situation. I have a uh, 13 by 9 pan here. I've already pre-greased it. So we're ready to go there. I've got the oven set to 350. It's already preheated, ready to go. That is crucial. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put about two-thirds of this cake batter in this pan here. Give a little shift make sure we cover all the bottom. Alright, so what I'm going to do, just for the fun of it, is just sprinkle these blueberries all over this goodness. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, God, blueberry women. Yeah, it's nice. Alright, let's not get crazy. <laughs> just some more. Yeah, there we go. Pour the remainder of this here batter. Over the top. So we're going to put this cake in the oven, 350 once again, preheated. Once this cake comes out of the oven. Three quarters of a cup of boiling water going. We're going to mix some lime gelatin in there. One packet, small packet. I've put one and a half cups of milk in this bowl. I've used organic milk because it's delicious. What I'm going to do here is put one packet of lemon pudding instant mix. And I'll put one thing of whipped cream topping dehydrated form. We're going to whip this thing into shape here. Make sure all that stuff's mixed together. It's starting to thicken up a little bit as you can see. Got some lavender. That's lovely. Nice purple color. Very, very fragrant. Um, let's just start. About a half teaspoon. A little goes a long way with this stuff. It usually comes pretty potent. My mom's probably cursing me right now. Let's bump it up a little bit. Put about a teaspoon in there. 
Why have it in there if you can't taste it or see it? In this case, and smell it. And about this time, I feel like this cake is going to be at a beautiful perfection. We're going to open her up. Wow, look at that golden brown. Holy moly. Let's check that out. Nothing sticking. Let it sit for 20 minutes before you apply this jello. And back to the wine. Nutmeg, almond, that's very nice. I'm gonna go back for another. Okay, so what we're gonna do here, we got our finished cake. It's been setting for 20 minutes on this rack, so it's evenly cooling from underneath. We've got our jello substance that we mixed together. It's not room temperature. We also have our topping. This little bit of lavender thrown in there. So what we're going to do is take this uh, nice little wooden, wooden uh, spoon here. And we're going to aggressively just bash down into this cake. Oh man, that is so much fun. Oh, we're just beating the shit out of this cake. Now we're going to take our lemon lime substance. We're going to try to pour it evenly over the cake. Try to cover each a hole and crevice. Now what we're going to do is take that whip topping. Oh, that's looking really nice. You can smell that nice lavender. We're going to plop it on top. I want every last scraping of this substance. Okay guys, nice even layer over the cake. Deliciousness. That's what that's called, Camille. Let's wrap this guy up and get it in the fridge. Guys, at least let this set for 8 to 24 hours. 24 recommended. Muito diferente.